Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to share with you our mini loofah farm. It's actually a trial farm. Um, this was actually in one of our future plan, which is to have a small farm. And loofah is one of the crop that we consider putting in the farm. So uh, because loofah is very easy to grow, as you know, and it doesn't require much care. So we are fortunate enough to have this piece of land for the trial. It was actually my sister-in-law. She allowed us to use her piece of land for this trial. So we're going to share with you how we start everything from scratch and also the update. So the very first thing we did is measuring our garden bed. So this one going to be a 50 feet long bed. After we measure and make sure that we have the bed that we want, we put the marking and we start digging the edges of the bed. Since we're not going to be able to check on the loofah every day, so we decided to make a garden bed that requires less maintenance. So we make a sharp and neat edges so that there will not be any weed growing on the side of the garden bed and after that we cover the whole bed with landscape fabric that way we don't have to worry about uh, weeding the whole garden bed hands up there like you just don't care yeah. So for the trellis, we're using cattle panel and we tie them on the post with just a zip tie, a very simple trellis. garden bed look like we leave this garden bed for a week before we start putting the seedling in this garden bed and for planting the seedling since this property have chicken running around the yard so i decided to use a solo cup to protect my young and tender seedling so this is how i prepare the solo cup i make a big hole at the bottom of the cup and then i push the cup all the way in and then I fill in the cup with fertilizer and dirt before putting in the seedling. And that way the chicken won't be able to get to the root of my plant and therefore increase the survival of my seedling.
that's the update that we have for you today. If you like to know more on the progress of the Lufa that we have this year, consider subscribing to our channel and I will share with you more on the progress and I'll see you next time.